time in Franklin history? How's it feel? Yeah, it's it's an amazing feeling. This atmosphere out here is just absolutely nuts. And I loved every single second of it, and I'm sure the rest of the team did. And, and, and what a game. What a game right there to play. And that's the games you play for. That's why you play the game. And, and I'm just happy we came out on top. So you kind of taking in the moment there afterwards. What, what does this win mean to you and be able to close that out for your team? It means everything. It's, you know, I've been dreaming of this moment since I could pick up a baseball. I've been coming to these games since, since I was six years old. And, and to be out here and, and actually get the opportunity to get on the mound and go compete, it's a dream come true, and, and I loved every minute. Well, obviously the job's not done, right? So how do you live in this glory for a little bit, but then switch it over real quick? Yeah, you know, it's, it's amazing. It's an amazing thing that we, that we were able to come out with the W right there. This team, they fought their, their butt off every pitch, every out. And, uh, but, uh, you know, with the mentality, once you leave this place right here is, is to get ready for Brock tomorrow. And, and I have no doubt in my mind that this team right here will be ready to go. Corey Walker came in there, uh, pinch hit, you know, gets this. Puts it that running, uh, puts, give you guys a run, put y'all back ahead there in the six. Just how big of that bat was that for him? And yeah, man. That was a huge moment. That's, that's a complete momentum sway in the game. You know, the, the mentality he had, you know, hasn't gotten that bat yet, and he comes up to the plate in that big of a situation, and he, he gets it down, he does the job, and, and you know, he, he's been out all year with an injury, unfortunately, and, and he's been able to take advantage of every opportunity he's gotten, and I'm so happy for him, I'm so happy for this team, and, and it, it was amazing. Noah had a big day at the plate, two, three RBIs. Uh, what did you see from him, and uh, I mean, is that something you guys kind of expect from him? Or? Yeah, no, you know, Noah Tart is going to is gonna fight through everything. You know, he made, he made a little mistake in the, in the field right there, and I told him when I came in the dugout, I said, hey, you're going to have a chance to, to get that back, and, and he sure did. He put one down the line that, that you know, eventually led to that three-run inning, and it was a big uh, spot in the game to, to make that happen, and I'm, I'm super proud of it. You know, had that quick little mound visit there in the, in the bottom of the seventh. Uh, what was just maybe the message from the coach? What did you guys talk about there? Yeah, you know, it, it was pretty much how bad do you freaking want it? You know, he's, he's came out there, he said, you prepared these four years of high school baseball for this moment right here. He had no doubt in me that I was going to be able to get it done, and, and he was right. I, I, I appreciate Coach Anderson and everything he does for us, and I, I appreciate him letting me, you know, finish that out right there and everything to me. And, and uh, it was pretty much just to get my breath back under me, and it was a, it was a really good decision by him. Evan, uh, last one for me, but just how much of a relief to seeing AJ make the throw to Eric and get the tag out there. Oh, my God, how about that? No, you know, I, I have a bad little thing about doing throwing it away when I pick off, but... I saw him get to it pretty quick, and, and I watched the runner around second, and that kid is going to be really special, AJ. He's a great player. He's got a great arm, and it, as soon as I saw that throw, I knew it was going to be right on the money, and, and sure enough, it was, and it was a great moment, a great play by him, and, and it just hats off to him.